What if everyone wants to grow super and look who I'm with, Libby Renee, because she's awesome sauce. And she's approved, super approved, because she's a unicorn. You can just see everything right here, unicorning out. Just watch her. Wasn't that just the best intro to my videos you have ever seen? Hey guys, so I went to YouTube and fast, and oh my god, it was literally the best day of my life. And I got so excited because I met every single one of my idols. And I met Tyler Oakley, my queen. He is my literal queen. And Jenna Marbles, I also got to meet her, who is the queen of YouTube. And Ryan Higger, who I didn't get to meet for very long. But I did get to see him, and I got a hug, and I, and I got to... Oh, uh, the feels! <laughs> so this video is all about my experience and time at YouTube Fan Fest 2004. It's it's 2014 this year, but it was literally the best day of my life, and I will never forget it as long as I live. And my brain has been non-stop just going, replaying every single moment of it ever since we left, and I did not get any sleep because of it. Right, so first of all. I started vlogging, I tried vlogging, and this is how it went. Hey guys, and we are here at going up an escalator, and we are going on the train. <laughs> to YouTube Fan Fest. To YouTube Fan Fest. At Chatswood Station. At Chatswood Station. Yeah, you're on call. And it's going to be exciting. Yay! Now we are walking down the street to go to Luna Park, to go to Jenna Marbles, meet and greet. Yay! Hey guys, and right now we are at Luna Park. Yay! And we got here really, really early, and there's no one else. And we're waiting for Jenna Marbles to show up at, you know, whenever she's showing up. Because I don't think that there's anyone else. So we arrived at Luna Park at 6.30 because we thought that there was going to be millions of people like lining up to go and see Jenna Marbles but we were the first people there, me and my dad and then we were waiting there for like 4 to 5 hours I don't know, we were there from 6.30 and then more people started coming in around about like 5ish but then we had to wait till like 11 o'clock to actually meet her the meetup was scheduled for 9.30 but then it got to 10 o'clock and she had an interview then so she had to do the interview and then we actually got to meet her at 11 o'clock and I met her I was the second person to meet her and she was so sweet to me and I actually cried and I cried on Jenna Marble's shoulder. The picture. Right there. Picture. So the actual queen of YouTube. I got to cry on her shoulder. I'm so happy but I'm like so disappointed with myself that I cried. But she was like, oh no, you're so sweet. Stop crying, you're gonna make me cry. And I was like, oh my god, you're Jenna Marbles. So right at the end of meeting her, she gave me this little thing, a little picture of her. I'm gonna put the picture right here. It's here. So she gave me this little picture that has like to Libby, I love you from Jenna. And she was so sweet. She was so much sweeter in real life than I expected. I expected she'd be like, okay, hug, picture. Go on kids, bye. Got more people to meet. And I was, and then she was really nice to me and I was like so happy. And she made me like the happiest person in the world. Also, Jenna Marbles smelled amazing. So after that, we went down to the big top box office and we were like could we get some like meet up wristband things to meet superwoman and so we got the little wristbands for that and then we sort of wandered down to where all the other meet and greets were and we walked in because we thought that everyone was lining up to go see superwoman and Bethany and then so we walked into like this building that had all the other meet and greets going on because we thought that everyone was lining up to go to superwoman and Bethany Motor. But then we saw this sign and it was like Tyler Oakley, Ryan Higger, My Chani, and Vsauce and I was like, wait. And then, so we asked the person and they're like, oh no, that's at one o'clock. And we were like, oh, okay. So we like walked out, we walked down a bit. And then I actually thought, I was like, hang on, that sign said Tyler Oakley. 
what does that mean? And so I was like, okay, let's just go and ask the people. So we went and we asked, and they're like, oh yeah, here's like a little wristband to meet Tyler Oakley. And I've still got that wristband because it like had T-O on it, and it, like, I'm just assuming that it meant Tyler Oakley. Um, and it said, it had the little like YouTube fan vest like symbol thing. And I was like, okay, cool, I'm gonna meet Tyler Oakley in like five minutes. So I quickly wrote him a little note with my Twitter on it. And like, I was like, I love you so much. Please, please, please follow me on Twitter. It would mean the entire world to me, which it would. And he hasn't followed me yet. And I'm a little bit sad about that, but I'm sure he's just been busy and like tired and stuff since a lot of the other YouTubers went to bed at like one o'clock. Cause I saw that on Twitter when I woke up at like eight o'clock, like it was like seven hours ago, finally going to bed by Bethany Motor. So once we finally got in, I lined up to meet Tyler. Tyler, my queen, my literal queen, my Tyler, 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 my, oh, I love him so much. So you, you do not actually believe how excited I was to meet him. We lined up and I went and I hugged him and I started tearing up because like it's Tyler Oakley. I was in, standing in front of Tyler Oakley. I went and I hugged him and then I started almost crying and then he hugged me again. And let me just describe Tyler Oakley's hugs to you. Imagine the best hug you have ever had. Now times that by 10. I genuinely felt like he was being friendly towards me and I felt like he was actually my friend like I already knew him like knew him personally and I just felt so protected it's like the most amazing hug I have ever had I gave him a little letter with my like Twitter on it and then like I just got so like frightened I was like oh my god you're Tyler Oakley and so I just started freaking out and so my dad did most of the talking but then like right towards the end I was like oh so and he's like yeah and I was like can you marry my dad oh my god Tyler said yeah maybe someday maybe someday and I was the only thing that's running through my mind at this point was he didn't say no so he was absolutely fabulous and really really nice and my dad got a picture with him and I got a picture with him here's the picture with me and Tyler and I got to put my arms around him and then here's the picture of Tyler with my dad which I thought was very very exciting because you know it's Tyler and it's my dad the two most favorite people in my life so then once we were done meeting Tyler the guys the like security people were like okay now if you want to go and meet anyone else in the room you can go do that and so like I felt sorry for poor old Tony because he had like no one lining up for him and he actually had to leave early because no one was like lining up for him so I went over and I said hi to him here's a picture of me with him I got to hug him and I was like oh my god you're the third person that I ever started watching on YouTube and then he was like oh too bad I wasn't your first and I was like but Jenna was my first and I already told her that. So I went and I met Tony and he was really kind and then we went and we lined up to go see Ryan Hager and he was sort of like, they were rushing people. They were like, okay, listen, you just gotta hurry up. You gotta be quick. And so I only got to like give him a hug and then like I got a picture with him. Here's a picture with me and Ryan Hager cause he was so nice. And then the other people in the room were Veritizum. And Vsauce and I didn't really want to go see them because I was like too nervous because I didn't know that much about them so I was like okay let's go then and then we left and then when we left there was already people like lining up loads of people to see Bethany Motor and Superwoman and I was like oh this must be for Superwoman and Beth and so we started lining up and the lineup was so huge and then they're like okay if you're here to see Superwoman come over here if you're see if you're here to see Bethany come over here and so we went over into the Superwoman line and like literally two thirds of the crowd went over to go see Bethany and I was like wow I did not realize Bethany Motor was that amazing like I like her she's I, she's cool I like her but like Superwoman it's Woman, you know and then so like tons of people got in before us there was like 11 people or something that pushed in front of us to see Superwoman but when I did get to see her I got a picture with her I got a selfie with her here's a selfie with her I know it's like a little retarded but like I got to take a selfie with Superwoman and here's a picture with me and her just like that my dad took 
she was really really sweet and really nice and she did that little intro thing that I love so much because she was so nice and she's like yo what up everyone it's girl superwoman and I was like oh, I'm so and I totally would have gone and seen Beth because she looked fabulous. I thought the lineup was like massive, so I was just like, you know something, let's just go and get some ice cream. So we went and we got some ice cream. It's time to go and line up to go to the actual show. Yay! So when we got into the show, there was loads of lining up, and then there was more lining up, but then we got these other wristbands. And I've still got that one as well. So we lined up and then we went into the show. like 10 minutes of waiting for everyone to get there and everyone to tune into the live stream. Yes, there was a live stream and if you want you can come and click it here to go and watch it because it was amazing and you might see me somewhere. So we got pretty good seats, we were pretty close to the stage and at first I was like a little shy to get up and like start cheering and screaming. The first person who came out was Jenna and I was like, oh my god, I love her so much. So they did a little interview sort of thing with Jenna and she was so sweet and so nice and then after her some more people came out and some more people came out and I was still shy for this entire thing. I was just like, whoa. This was where I really broke when Troy and Tyler came out. <laughs> when Troy and Tyler came out, I was literally up on my chair, screaming, breaking out. And that was when the, uh, the entire crowd got so excited. Here's a little video of what the crowd was like. I'm Harry Styles. And Troy and Tyler was like, okay guys, just chill. So she's like, chill, bro. So I absolutely lost it with them and then afterwards, um, who was it, Superwoman came out and she like came out and I was like, I was literally like, <gasps> the entire time I was like, Superwoman! So Lily was so nice and she did a little dance, here's a little clip of that little dance. awesome and I screamed for her as well and then when everyone came out I like went down to the stage and I was like oh my god it's everyone and I definitely felt like I was at home in the end because here in my little town that we live in no one literally not a single goddamn person says yes but there Every five seconds you are hearing someone going, yes, yes. So it was very, very exciting and it was an awesome day and I got to meet everyone. Everyone. I love you guys. I'll see you in my next video. Goodbye.